Hello friend, I am Rameshwar and today we will discuss about one of the important aspect or an initiative launched by Food Safety and Standard Authority of India. The initiative named as Food Safety Mitra that is FSM. Friends, Mitra means your near or dear friend who could help you, maybe assist you or he is there during your requisite condition. And it is rightly quoted that a friend in need is a friend indeed. With consent to same, I must say that food safety mitra are you the true friends for different food business operator that is FBO. Friends, now our rest of the session is concerned to how the FSM that is food safety mitra are a requisite true friend with the consent to food business operator. I have to say here one thing that these scheme is most of all important for the different food graduates, maybe the food professionals or with concern to the different food bodies. Friends, keep in mind one thing, it is helpful for different undergraduate students, postgraduate one, PG, PhD scholars and most of the discipline of food arena. Apart from that, this initiative is typically helpful for number of graduates with their discipline. So be with me till the last. Friends, currently India is second largest populated country and at the same time one of the topmost in concern to the food grain production. That's why India is called as food basket to the world. Generally, Indian food industry is scattered one and it is divided into organized sector, unorganized sector and small scale industry in which again organized sector contributes merely to 25% only. Hence, it clearly means many food businesses are not registered till date. So, with concern to the statistical data, we could say 32 lakh food businesses along with 1.55 lakh food safety supervisors and 600 odd hygiene rating or auditing establishments. So, there is a great challenge to fed up the people on one side and to create more opportunities on another side. So, as a food authority, the main focus is on to convert all challenges into the requisite opportunity with the help of the initiative that is Food Safety Mitra. India is currently at 77th position in terms of ease of doing business and its wish to be there in top 50 list. With consent to the same, FSS AI changes its, its approach from regulator to enabler. Now it is helping hand. Hence, to enable this food safety ecosystem at a ground level, the authority launches the scheme that is Food Safety Mitra and here the main target or the main focus is towards attract the different types of motivated individual so that they could be the game changer. So here the main question is what is the term Food Safety Mitra? Friends, it is an individual professional certified by Food Safety Standard of India and performs limited actions on behalf of or for food business operator with respect to the implementation of Food Safety Act, rules and regulations. Friends, here the second question could be that what is the specific role given to the food graduate, PG holder or to the different students from science background. Food Safety Mitra that is FSM scheme is launched by Ministry of Health and Family Welfare by the hands of Honorable Dr. Harsh Vardhan on 16th October 2019 that is World Food Day and the theme for World Food Day is Healthy Diets for a Zero Hunger World. Here I could say three specific roles are there with concern to the Food Safety Mitra. Specific roles are like registration and licensing, food safety training and hygiene auditing. So now we move toward first one that is registration and licensing. With consent to Eat India movement, we could say we have to increase the registered or licensed food business operator from 32 lakh to 60 lakh and it could be possible only if the FBOs could operate with a licensed business or they could renew their business and they need IT tools that is information tools to upgrade themselves and here I must say that food business operator need the IT tools and for the same concern, food safety mitra are the service provider to them. Second important role is 
food safety training here i must quote food authority launched food safety training and certified program that is hostag for improvement in food safety auditor or food safety supervisors so here i must say that we have to increase the food safety auditor from 1.55 lakh that is currently 1 to 10 lakhs and that could be possible with the help of the program of train the trainer and with the help of food safety mitra third important aspect of the role is hygiene auditing or hygiene rating friends i must say that we are way behind in terms of hygiene rating and according to eat right india movement we have to increase the establishment of such to 60000 which is currently only 600 so with concern to that authority main focus is to impart the students who have specific domain knowledge of the food discipline so friends yahan pe domain knowledge bahut matter karta hai kyunki agar aap food background se ho so definitely you have the basic knowledge of the industry that is the food industry aur yahan pe food safety mitra ko appoint karne ke liye domain knowledge bahut zyada zaruri hai so with concern to that i must say basic knowledge of the food industry of the food sector is required for the same Friends, third important question is how the food safety mitra operated at a ground level? What is their operational structure or what are the different guidelines? Friends, food safety mitra is a three tier structure or we could say three avatars are there and these are digital mitra, then trainer mitra and lastly hygiene mitra. With concern to that, I must say here the specific role for the digital mitra regarding licensing and registration, filling applications annual returns or declaration and others with consent to trainer mitra food safety training conducting training of food safety supervisor under the four stack and for the hygiene mitra to audit hygiene of fbo outlets hygiene guidelines to train the food safety supervisors and food handlers about safe and hygienic food handling practices to attain the goal of hygiene and safe eating throughout the india Friends, here I must suggest you one thing that rather than an individual, you act as a resource person for different operations or different food business operator. Or, isi anusar, jin candidate ka background food business ya food science ya food technology ke related hai, wo yaha pe bahut acha kaam kar sakte hai. Or, that is a great opportunity for the science graduate student also. Friends, our next question is the eligibility criteria. With consent to the eligibility criteria for the digital mitra, he must possess a bachelor's degree from any recognized university with a specific knowledge of computer and internet and an age limit of 21 to 60 years that is for the digital mitra. And with consent to trainer mitra, we could say there are three different types of level that is basic, advanced level and special level. And with consent to the different criteria, we go one by one that is first one is the educational qualification. In all the three, they have the education qualification of a science graduate, food science graduate, chemistry, microbiology in their graduation. And for the basic level, they have minimum five years experience in relevant food industry. With consent to advanced level, they must have seven year experience in the relevant industry. And with consent to special level, they have the experience of seven years in any specific food industrial sector. Then second criteria is the training and implementation experience here minimum three years with concern to the food safety and hygiene that is FSMS or HSCCP in relevant food industry for advanced level minimum five years for the same and for the special level five years of training and implementation on food safety in relevant food industry for the concern to the general training received they have the proper knowledge of FSS rules and regulation. And at the same time, they have good communication and motivation skills and shall be available for training of 20 days in a year. With consent to the hygiene mitra, the specific age limit is against 21 to 60 years and the candidate must possess bachelor's degree in recognized university from the different disciplines like food, agricultural sciences, hotel management, catering technology, oil technology from the background of microbiology, biochemist and dairy and fishery likewise at the same time the candidate must possess the specific knowledge of food safety standard acts rules and regulations apart from that he
he must have the specific domain knowledge of the hygiene specific requirement in the food industry friends now we move on towards the obligations point of view that is the code of conduct typically includes three thing these are integrity transparency and quality with concern to integrity the food safety mitra have the integral part of the system hence he must possess the integrity among the work at the same time i must say that the different types of things he has to possess and these are like diligence at all times during filling of application conducting audit that is the hygienic one adv advising food business operator for correctly about the processes regulation requirement and their liabilities at the same time rectify the misdeclaration and non compliances from fbos charging only the prescribed fees from client against the given receipt with consent to the integrity here the main aim is to help out different types of food business operator with regu with regulated compliance second one is the transparency yes there should be a transparent manner with the way of work food safety mitra handled it mainly includes application filed on behalf of food business operator so code their unique identification number service charges communicated to fbo and share the receipt and acknowledgement for the same without authority they will not use logo of fssi name or represent them as officers of food safety authority and with consent to quality food safety mitra how to maintain the quality in terms of filling the application form having the regulations process or different things which includes typically auditing hygienic practices likewise friends now we move ahead with consent to the renewal and cancellation of food safety mitra certificate with consent to that i must say the validity given for the certificate is of 2 years and one has to pay rupees 5000 as a safety deposit and he may collect the deposit at the time he exit from the arena friends food safety mitra has to continue his work unless and until certificate is suspended or withdrawn the scheme is withdrawn by the authority itself or there is no renewal of the license given to the food safety mitra friends the certificate of food safety mitra can be cancelled on the basis of certain grounds and these are like if state food authority report any misconduct by fsm if fsm refuses to give a copy of receipt to the food business operator if he fails to give his name or unique identification number in the application if he makes repeated mistake during filling of applications or returns engaged in any financial irregularity or fraud fails to comply with the direction given by the food authority makes a wrong or fraudulent application or returns despite being in the know any act in the violation of guidelines or fails to upgrade skills concerned to the food authority one thing keep in mind before cancellation of certificate given to the food safety mitra food authority give an opportunity for the fsm to explain his or her position for the concerns right. now we move towards what are the different types of benefits or conclusion for the scheme with concern to that the first and foremost important is the benefit to the food safety mitra we could say that is the opportunity of self employment to the food safety mitra concern to same i must suggest that during the lockdown when many more food professional food graduates or different graduates from science background they are stuck at their home during the lockdown condition so this is a golden opportunity to employ the way a with concern to the food safety mitra scheme friends i know one thing very clear that these candidates know the food industry very well so rather than the other people if they employ themselves in terms of different food safety mitra scheme then that could be a good opportunity to them also to their near and dear ones so it is opportunity which could be created and which could be distributed among the all friends this could be opportunity for the for them also and for the whole food fraternity to employ in the food safety mitra scheme i must say that the industry though it's look like nascent stage in current situation but that could be a major boost in the service industry in the coming future because as there are 25 lakh food business operator and if one has to pay rupees 2000 to rupees 3000 on the licenses renewal or many services then the whole industry caters is nearly rupees 
फाइव हंड्रेड करोड़ सो दैट कुड बी अ ग्रेट अपॉर्चुनिटी एंड अगेन विथ कंसर्न टू द फूड अथॉरिटी देयर मेन एम इज टू एंगेज डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ मोटिवेटेड एंड साइंस बैकग्राउंड पीपल विथ एटलीस्ट फिफ्टी थाउजेंड इंडिविजुअल्स करेंटली आई कुड से देर आर नाइन थ्री टू सेवन डिजिटल मित्रा फोर थाउजेंड सिक्स हंड्रेड सिक्सटी टू ट्रेनर मित्रा एंड फोर थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड ट्वेंटी फोर हाइजीन मित्रा एंगेज इन टू द अथॉरिटी सो मस्ट सजेस्ट देर कुड बी अ लार्ज स्कोप बिकॉज इन द कमिंग डेज दैट कुड बी ईरा ऑफ सर्विस इंडस्ट्री टू फैसिलिटेट डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ फूड बिजनेस ऑपरेटर फ्रेंड्स अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट वन स्पेशल प्रोविजन इज गिवन फ्रॉम द अथॉरिटी पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू दैट यू मे ऑप्ट फॉर मोर देन वन scheme that is you if suppose you are there in the digital mitra then also you opt for the trainer mitra and hygiene mitra also as per the specific requirements second aspect is ease of doing business with the help of food safety mitra we are able to create a transparent qualitative and organized ecosystem which support different food businesses and on the website you could able to see service provider in your nearby location with their charges one is strengthening compliance with the help of scheme food authority improves compliance environment and future move ahead for regulatory compliance fourth one is timely resolution with concern to the different food business operator the scheme act as a timely resolution for fbos with concern to their need application status training or hygienic rating for their business hence in a nutshell i could say that food safety mitra is a self driven self regulatory compliance structure which is a helping hand to the food safety and standard authority of india on one hand and state food authority on other hand friends i definitely feel this information is helpful to you if you have any query then text me in the comment section i will try to solve the same if but it's your first time on my channel then don't forget to click on like and subscribe button and hit on the bell icon friends i am trying to cover such things or such parameters as per your suggestions I am also thankful to Mr Akshay Burse who helped me out for the session thank you all